Hello one and all, welcome to a Galaxy Man Show here. Uh, so basically today I will be doing an interview with Maddie G uh, Music. Uh, if anyone hasn't heard of her, she has a new song release out uh, called Cards You, Play Cards you Played. Uh, and yeah, I'm going to give you a brief demo of what it's like. It's so incredible. Uh, so I'll get her on live um, once I play a snippet of Cards You Played. So hope you all enjoy, uh, and I'll get Maddie on straight after I play a snippet of her song. You had your chance, but you blew it, blew it. I gave you all of me, but you threw it, threw me away. I did nothing but love you and be loyal to you, but it wasn't enough for you. So go on, walk away I'm sure I'll miss you But I, I know I'm better off without you Cause you didn't care that much But like a fool, I stayed in touch But not anymore I don't care if you think I'm wrong It's a red fed up, I moved on But you gotta deal with how the dust Well, there you all go. Uh, there was a snippet of Cards You Played. Definitely go check it out on Maddie G's uh, YouTube channel. Uh, it's incredible. Uh, so I'm just waiting for Maddie G to come on the live now. And yeah. Uh, yeah. Maddie, I'll get you to introduce yourself. I'm Maddie G. I have a song that just came out today. It's called Cards You Played. Awesome. Uh, so for my first question, uh, what was it like writing and creating Cards You Played? Uh, and what is the meaning behind the song? What was it like writing and creating Cards You Played? Um, I wrote it. It was honestly one of the easiest songs I wrote. It came together very quickly. Um, it all kind of just fell into place really nicely. Um, uh, yeah, I really enjoyed writing this song. I found that it was very fun and a good way to channel my emotions at the time. Um, and I guess, yeah, that brings me to what it's about. Um, the song is really about, well, a friendship gone south, but um, it, you can interpret it however you choose to interpret it. Um, I kind of just wanted to create a song that was relatable to everyone, no matter like what your situation is. Um, but I wanted to, like, with my first song, Poison, I kind of did a more kind of, like, screw you song instead of, like, yeah, what you did sucked, but look at how much I've grown from it. Like, this is, it's not my fault alone. Like, it's the joint thing, you know? And yeah. so I think I just wanted to make sure that I got that across in the song, is that, you know, just when things don't go right doesn't mean it's always all your fault and sometimes you just gotta grow from it take the positives you know awesome well for my next question uh <laughs> who would be your top three favorite artists to work with in the industry in the music music industry oh top three favorite artists to work with that's hard oh okay um i personally am obsessed with sabrina carpenter she is my favorite singer <laughs> Um, so I would absolutely love to work with her. Um, I, oh, there's so many. Wow, that's hard. Okay. Um, okay. I'm trying to not just pick my favorite artist. I'm trying to think who would I like to write with, who, who's like production, would I be loving. Yep. I think maybe Halsey, because I am obsessed with the way that the production on her songs and the way that she tells the story. And it's just so insane. Like everything is so coordinated really well and so I think it would just be insane to work with her um and probably hmm, maybe Taylor Swift I I love Taylor Swift so much her songwriting is probably like one of the main reasons I still write today because I was very inspired by her so probably yeah Taylor Swift I would love to work with awesome well for my next question uh yeah. 
how long have you been in the music industry for and who inspired you to get into music? Who inspired me? Um, I've been in the music industry. I don't know that you, I don't, would I count myself as in the music industry? I don't know. I've I, been. I reckon, I reckon I would because <laughs> you have the talent for it and you oh, are you. really incredible. So yeah. Thank you so much. Um, I have been singing, I've been singing since I was like eight, um, performing since I was also eight. But I really began songwriting and pursuing this um, when I was about 13 or 14. I'm like 16, nearly 17 now. Um, yeah. And so I think, I think I've think i always just kind of been into music. It was always a big part of my life growing up. Not to say my parents were necessarily musical, but um, music was always a big part of me growing up. Um, and it would constantly be played and it would just always be a constant for me and something that I always found comfort in. And so I was just like, I want to create that same kind of a space for other people, you know, because I used to write poetry a lot when I was younger. And so I think I just wanted to be like able to create the same kind of like solace that I felt through music for others, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Well, for my next question, uh, if anyone wants to get into uh, creating their own music, what advice would you give that person? What advice? Um, I think just go for it. I think that's like, honestly, the biggest piece of advice because I feel like a lot of people just tend to think, oh, I can't do that. And then they just never try. But I think one of the biggest things is just trying and keeping on going and just um, developing your skills in it, you know? Like it's about just keeping on going and uh, constantly writing because like I wrote a lot of horrible songs when I was younger you just gotta keep perfecting your craft you know I think that's probably the biggest piece of a device though is just to actually give it a fair shot and not just like be like I can't do that and then just never really try you know yeah well for my next question uh what would be your top three favorite songs to sing top three favorite songs to sing yeah. like of all time pretty much yeah Oh god, that's hard. Top three favorite songs to sing. Wow. Um. Hmm. That is very difficult. <laughs> I. Wow, I've never actually thought about that. <laughs> um. I think probably. Hmm. I love "I Will Survive" by Gloria Gaynor. Um. It is just such a fun song. And I was not alive when it came out, obviously. I am like five compared to that song. But uh, it was one of the first songs I learned how to sing. And so I think I just have a very special connection to that song. And so it's always kind of been a big part of me. And so I think that's easily one of my favorite songs to sing. Also, it's a classic. <laughs> Bob is like, I will survive. You know, it's like so good. Just like um, that opera kind of song. Yeah. yeah. Uh, oh, two more, two more. Uh, I think probably, hmm, If I Ain't Got You by Alicia Keys. I love that song so much. Nice. And, oh, hmm, I don't know. That's so hard. <laughs> so many songs to choose from. Uh, I don't know. Havana. I love performing Havana a lot. Yeah. That's one of my favorite songs. Awesome. Well, uh, for my uh, next question uh, for you, Maddie, um, what would be like the positive and negative sides uh, in creating music? Positive and negatives? Um, positive, for sure, getting to create the music and seeing what everyone thinks of it. I think that's my favorite thing of all is seeing um, how people feel about the music and what it makes them feel and how it's just the most exciting thing in the world is to see people hear something that you've been working on for so long. Um, I think one of the negatives is for sure just like, well, I don't think it's a negative necessarily, but like all the planning that goes into it, like behind all the behind the scenes stuff that needs to be done when, you know, like as a creative person, I was like, I just want to put my music out there, but then I'm like, yeah, but I have to do this, this and this or else it's gonna, no one's going to hear it. Um, so I think that's a little bit of a drawback, but it's just part of life. <laughs> but um, yeah. Awesome. Well, for my last and final question, uh, yeah. why should people check uh, check out your song, Cards You Played? 
Why? Because it's a bop. That song slaps. <laughs> Sorry, I, I've worked really, really hard on it. And I'm just so excited for people to finally be able to hear it. I wrote it like, oh gosh, I wrote it ages ago now. Maybe like uh, a year and a half ago, probably. So it's like, it's not, I wouldn't say it's an old song, but I've had it in my like, with me for like a while and I've just been waiting for people to hear it because I'm like, it's so good. <laughs> so um, you should just go listen to it for sure. It's a good song. <laughs> yes, definitely do that everyone. Uh, check out the cards you played. Uh, I just want to thank you so much, Manny, for thank coming you. on. Uh, it means so much. You are truly incredible and so talented. You have no idea how talented you, are. you, you, you actually really are. Uh, so everyone oh, go check out. So uh, and yeah, uh, she's truly incredible. Definitely go check out Cards You Play. So thank you so much for joining and see you all next yeah. time.